for coming back to the channel. So today we are in Sam's. Um, I didn't plan on going to Sam's. I thought about it, but didn't plan on it. Um, and then I said, well, let me go ahead and go in there. I'm not gonna spend a ton in here. And I was like, let me go ahead and, um, not a ton, I'm not gonna spend a lot. And then I said, let me go ahead and turn the camera on. So I really wanna get meats today. And that's not gonna go far in here, but um, no, it's gonna go far. We're not gonna talk like that. All right, y'all. Hey, y'all. So I get to browse today, um, more so, as I really don't have a deadline or just trying to get home before this and get home. But anyway, I like this wall clock. Um, and it's only 1998. Um, do I want to go down there? Not really. Um, so I do want some palm toilet paper. Right, so I'm gonna have to cut this because I don't know how loud the music is. But it took us, the last video I uploaded, it's probably about two and a half months. Maybe almost two months. No, two months. Um, and this last us just about, it's a couple of rolls left. And it's twenty ninety eight, and I'm gonna get this again. Um, I don't want them to go into my coupon stockpile. I have not been couponing. Um, y'all, every week I say I'm gonna go to CVS at least, and I don't. So I needed some freezer bags, y'all. BJ's has the assortment. They don't have that here at Sam's. I don't think. Like the quart size, there's a gallon, the sandwich. But we still have some few sandwich. But I know that they're going back to school. Side takes his lunch and he wants to take a snack. But I'm gonna get these so to section out some meats, and I don't have any. That's the main reason. Um, we're still good on trash bags. I asked Jojo because Jojo does the trash. If not, I can order it on Sam's.com. Okay, let me go over here and look. That music finally cut off. I do need some paper plates. Oh, uh, let's see. Let me see what else they have instead of just getting the stuff that I normally get and leave. Uh, what Pom did this trip too is to get the boys out the house. They're always in the house because I'm working, even though you guys may not see a video of me working. Okay, while I'm in here, I'm gonna go ahead and get some plates and some of these um, half steam table pans. Y'all told me to close my pocketbook up. Y'all be watching. And told me to strap it to the pocket, um, to the cart. So let me do that. Y'all just got this purse from uh, TJ Maxx and it broke. And I'm gonna take it back because I ain't even had it a week. I'm gonna take it back. I just didn't feel like driving down there today. Okay, cool. Hmm, my pocketbook broke. Remember y'all went with me to get the pocketbook? Mm -hmm. So I can't hold the handle. Okay, y'all, so they have these cute pajamas for boys, girls too. You guys know I got all boys. $9.98, I'm not gonna get none today. My boys love some pajamas. Let's see, I'm looking for the joggers that are like $9.98. Um, you can buy them at sales.com for $19. Mm -hmm. They got your size on twelve dollars. <laughs> yeah, so I'm looking for the joggers that I saw on um is it O Sam's or something on Instagram? But I think all this stuff over here are, are adult stuff. So I'm gonna have to look online. And it's a lot of people with any kids stuff, so. Oh, you like those, JJ? The Gap. I ain't no Gap sell stuff at um, Sam's. You like those? No, yeah. Are you tired of those? You ready to wear jeans now? Yeah. 1867. Yeah, these are cute. From 12.98. I don't see the joggers, so I guess I still on sams.com. So we need some mayonnaise. Um, some of my mayonnaise is starting to, um, well, we're using it now. 
but I had to get rid of, I think, one or two from Aldi. And then it was one that came that I was afraid to look at, um, to use, because y'all know my fit is going to be busting stuff up. But I see that all of them look like that. Dark at the bottom, and then right here at the lid, it looks dark. So... Um, that's such a big container anyway. I'd rather have the squeezable ones even though they cost more. But um, um, the expiration date is December, so I had to think what month is this? I don't know why I feel like it's August. So um, December 2021. So mayonnaise is one of those things you probably want to make from scratch if you have to have it um, to stop pile because it doesn't last that long. Um, of course, you're going to need a lot if you're doing like salads, pasta salads, and um, oh, it's 10 crabs or tuna, chicken salad, stuff like that. But just by experience, it doesn't, it didn't go bad on me, but the date came up quicker. And I'm, one, I'm hesitant just to use mayonnaise um, past the date. I think it, it is one in the refrigerator that we're working on. But other than that, okay. They got Obey hot sauce. I wonder what that tastes like. Like every year, on a, there's a new Obey hot sauce. New year pops up. Seven, seventy-eight. I forgot to pick up the camera. So I picked up some meat so far and some vegetables. Um, let's see. I there are some chicken wings. There are very few, but I don't want no chicken wings that bad right now. They're twenty-one dollars. For seven pounds. I'm trying to see if I want some drumsticks though. These are a dollar eight cents a pound. Um, I'm walking those chickens down over there. Chance over the cell phone. I'm gonna get some drumsticks. Did y'all like them when I put them on the grill with barbecue sauce the other day? You did? Okay. So I'll get a pack of these. Hey guys, so I'm back from Sam's. Um, we are hot. And I think I forgot as my cart got fuller, I forgot to pick up the camera, y'all. So I apologize. Um, there were still some more things that I want to get, especially our go tos. I didn't get like a bunch of snacks and stuff this time. I was like, y'all don't need, y'all don't need that. And we have just a, you have some left in the trunk. One trunk is empty. So um, if you guys have been following along. So I went on this entire emergency food prepper pantry journey, not just um, prepper pantry, but also, or food, but also our emergency preps. So lately, I'm gonna upload this video before the other ones. I probably said this in some other videos, but this is the most current one. But lately y'all, what I've been up to is I have been working on something. Hopefully I'll be able to share that um, in the next couple of weeks. And, um, or a month in a couple of weeks. Um, so, and then also, you know, just because I don't have a video out, I have been working on my blog. I've been working on old seasonal content, putting it on my blog, just some of everything. And then also working on um, some self-care with myself, um, spending time with the Lord, learning more about myself. I want to make a video on some things that I have learned over this process. Over this time, it has, it's a lot. It's a lot. And I also wanted to kind of share some of the videos that I've been watching or people who I've been watching to just um, sh shift my mindset, positivity, um, more uh, spiritual, biblical pro um, standpoint, just improving myself overall. So I do have to do an update on my garden, y'all. It's growing, but it's not thriving. It's, it's not flourishing and um i'm just been busy doing every um some other things and some mishaps i think i saw a snake out there my bin broke and i got unmotivated so that's what happened so let me i'll put the prices up of what we got at sam's but i went on this emergency food prepper pantry and i've been getting some other things like some candles um a gas tank some of those things and i don't know if i recorded them but if i did i will um i need to go through my phone and camera and edit several videos um so we didn't i wanted to really concentrate on meats today and that's what i did my best of my ability but i really wanted to go to 
not really want to go to because I could have went. Um, I wanted to stock up at Aldi. So I really need to sit down and I should have took pictures of the price per ounce. So I can see what was a better buy. JJ was trying to help me with the chicken, which I still think is a better buy to get the individual smaller three pound bags of chicken breast, the frozen ones, than to get the great big one from Sam's, I believe. So anyway, um, yeah, I wanted to spend about 150 or one something at Aldi and just get meat. But I think we did pretty okay. Cause I have not been restocking um some of the things like these condiments and I this this will make almost about a about a year or a little over a year so some of the things like with the 2021 expiration date or best by sale date um or coming up <laughs> are coming up and I'm having to use them or I probably will have to take some of it's not a whole lot some of it to the um food bank which I don't mind at all because we had to do that for years so anyway y'all let's um it started. So I got some Prego and I got some Swaggerty sausages. I will make sure that I will put this. Last time I went, they didn't have this and they have not had none at Walmart the last couple of times I went. So I'll make sure I put at least half of this in the freezer. Well, I might put all of it because mama said it does just fine. I know it does because Food Line sells some in the um, meat area and in the frozen section. So because last time I went and I had like two rows that went bad. Okay, I have not seen the chicken fried rice, the members mark in a while. Um, I did go ahead and pick this up. It's easy and quick to put with a meal. So I picked that up, it was like $11.98. I'll put the prices y'all. Some chicken drumsticks. Um, I made some the other day. I think Jason and I had steak and the boys had chicken um, on the grill. And I put barbecue sauce. Um, that's a really good meal that I learned a long time ago that is low. Like if you don't have a lot of money, spaghetti, drumsticks. Um, that's the only ones I can think of right now, y'all. <laughs> spaghetti and drumsticks on a budget. Okay, some Power Wash triple pack. I needed this. I have not been couponing, y'all. I have been telling myself at least hope go to CVS every week or every other week, but I haven't even been getting the inserts, but you really don't need the inserts, but at least the PNG inserts you should get, Procter & Gamble. Okay, so I got some Heinz tomato ketchup. I was debating because we are not really uh, ketchup snobs or certain con well, ketchup snobs, so I was debating if I should just got it from Aldi because I could, for the price, $7, I could have got seven bottles. So I just went ahead and got it today. These might be a little bit bigger than Aldi. I have to see. I got some ground turkey today. Two of these, it was like $14. I got some milk. I really need to probably get two, especially when we have a lot of cereal, which we do right now, but um, don't have a lot of room at the top of the fridge sometimes. I got some mayo. I got this one versus the big bottle. Biscuits. These were like $5.98. You can't beat that. And then um, I was on, I have not been on Instagram or Facebook a whole lot. I get on there and I get off. I don't try to scroll mindlessly um, doing it, you know, wasting time for me and for some other reasons. So I had, so when I go on there, I go on there intentionally to go to certain accounts that I know, oh, I haven't been on here in a while let me see what they have picked up or what they're up to or if there's somebody has a sale so i think it's i had to put it down below it's one of the sam's accounts and they posted this chipotle chicken and cheese and they put this in the air fryer and i thought this would be good and it was like only i think two 260 it's look it's a pretty good size 260 calories if i'm not mistaken yeah, I didn't scan it to see how many points, but I thought I would try it. So I don't know how you pronounce it, but I wanted to try the stuff, chipotle chicken and cheese, and then uh, the bacon, hickory bacon. I got this. Now, when you freeze it, I don't know if it's when you freeze it or not, it gets more shredded. Um, but when you put it in the air fryer, it comes out okay, like it's not even shredded. But when you're pulling it apart, I don't know if it's because I put it in the freezer or what okay so i think their ground beef went up 
um it was like 30 maybe it's always been 30 something but i thought it was 27 before but today it was like 30 something i think you guys will see i think i have a clip of that so i didn't get that especially when i saw it was 90 percent lean which is what i need but the 90 percent lean to me is tasteless um it's tasteless like you need just a little bit of fat 80 at least 80 20 for it to taste like something so uh um, I got this American Wagyu ground beef and JJ said he heard some other YouTubers talk about this. And I think I have too, but, um, that was 16, 14. Then I got the sweet cream butter. I can't believe I went through, unless it's at the bottom, bottom of my freezer, all those big things of butter that I had. Um, but probably so, cause I haven't picked up any in a while. I got some of the steam table pans i was using these like when it was like cookouts and stuff like that and that is really helpful i got this big thing of chicken breast on um, the member mart and this is 10 pounds for 17 dollars okay i got members mart ultra 300 paper plates today and then i got the coat zero the big thing i needed some gallon um freezer bags so i got these and then the big palm 45 rolls so we have a couple of rolls left not many maybe three or four and this lasts almost two months almost two months um that's jason over there burping off y'all hear it Excuse so then here's some pop tarts um 32 variety pack um they wanted this kind this time and then i did since we were waiting in line i told them to go ahead and grab one thing of chips so they may have a few chips in there left but i'll just wait to see um when school starts then i'll go back and get them some drinks and stuff i have Jason's car i'll make sure i have Jason's car. okay so i got some broccoli for reds the four 16 ounce bags and they're like six seven dollars i got some of this broccoli on uh, normandy and it comes with all of those things and then I got the whole green beans. And lastly, we got the Fat Boys Premium Ice Cream, which we have not seen hardly in any stores. Um, this is the better buy, too, because it's like $11. When you go to Food Line, you spend in seven for one, something like that. But anyway, I also got some Eggo Homestyle Waffles. I had them at the door, <laughs> so I forgot about them. Some waffles, size size waffles. That's it, y'all. I don't know why I'm totally out of breath. I think because I'm really not taking a, a minute to breathe. Because <laughs> I be getting it on that treadmill. I'm proud of myself. I'm like um, incline a 2.0, 2.5 at a speed of 2.8. And I'm short, so my legs be getting it. So anyway, y'all, um, I'll see you guys in the very next video. I hope you guys are doing wonderful. And again, don't forget to download the it should be eight months of the meal plans. So check down in the description box and I'll see you guys in the very next video. Bye-bye.